Okay, Eric here. So this short tutorial is going to be on how to update your print manuscript from within your KDP interface. So it's pretty basic. So what I'll do is we'll first go through uh, a step by step here, and then I'll show you how to do it um, on the screen. So basically the first thing you want to do is you want to sign in to your KDP interface and go to your bookshelf. The next step you would do is click on the ellipse button under the paperback actions tab next to the book you want to update. And then you'd select edit print book content. This will take you to the paperback content page of the interface. And then you'll want to scroll down to the manuscript section and then click on upload paperback paperback manuscript, at which point you're going to find the file in your computer. Once you find the content, uh, click on it and it will upload. You'll see the following message, manuscript uploaded successfully, and at which time the conversion process will start. Now this will normally take a couple minutes depending on how large your file is. The next step you would do is you'd go to the book preview section, which is right below and you would then click the launch pre previewer and make sure that your updated manuscript looks as expected so this is basically like the digital proof that you're looking at right now now if the digital proof looks good to you then you're ready to click save and continue and this will take you to the paperback rights and pricing page uh, go ahead and scroll down the page until you see the publish your paperback book. So you go ahead and click that, that button, and you're done. It should take up to 72 hours for your book to update. So let's go to the uh, KDP account itself. So um, we've logged in here and we are in the bookshelf, as you can see from the books here. So find the book that you are wanting to change the manuscript um, and then go ahead go ahead and look for this little button here that's a little eclipse and you have a bunch of little options that show up and what you'll want to do is click on edit print book content okay now you're on the paperback content page so go ahead and scroll down until you find the manuscript. And this is where we would upload the paperback manuscript. So go ahead and click on that. So we're wanting to click on the latest uh, PDF of your manuscript. So I'll click on that. Go ahead and click open. And now it's uploading. Okay, so the cover uploaded successfully. Now it should be about ready. Yep. So once, um, as I said in the previous slide, it says the manuscript um, is uploading successfully and it's processing the file. So once it's processing the file, you can go on to the next step. So this is still processing. Now it's actually a very small file. So I think this simply needs to be refreshed. So what I would do is just simply just scroll up here, go ahead to back to the paperback details, and then go back to your paperback content. Scroll down. Oh. <laughs> that didn't change, you did it. So it's still um, processing file. So I'm surprised it's actually taking this long. Anyways, no worries. Um, let's just move forward. And I just saw that this is changing the book cover, but don't worry about all that stuff. It's not changing anything there. Um, even though this still says it's processing, we'll go ahead and, and launch um, the previewer. So let's see how long this takes. It's going to take a little time to prepare the files.
just checking some quality issues. You'll have to be a little patient sometimes depending on um, uh, the traffic or so forth, the demand on, on the website. If there's a high demand, high load, um, it will be slow. Okay, now it's checking the trim size. Checking, oh, I was checking the fonts, now it's not checking the fonts. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Okay, so I'm gonna just move this so that you can see. So there, here is a quality check and it'll let you know some of the things that you may want to check. Um, so I'm just looking at this here. Uh, it says they removed some non-stuff. I think that will be fine. And it's asking me to check this. Okay, so we're good to good to go there. That information is all good. So obviously, um, you'll find that this name is different. So I'm using a pin name. This is simply a test copy that I'm using. Uh, let's move this over. So basically what you'll want to do is just, um, you know, just scroll through, uh, see how the book looks. And if it looks okay to you, um, then that's basically what you, what you do is you just accept it and approve it. Okay, so looks like I'm good there. So let's go back. Okay. So what I'll do then is, since I'm happy with what I see, what we will do is we will approve the digital proof. That's what this is. So what I'll do is I'll have to put this in, in so that you can see it. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'll get this to move. Uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay, so I had to squeeze this in so you could see what the heck I was doing here. So we go ahead and hit this approve button, just like so. All right. So we'll just go ahead and scroll down. So, of course, now um, it's no longer processing, as you can see here. Um, so I scroll down, as you can see, the, the book cover came back. So it, it's basically not affecting the book cover. It's just um, um, we just simply uploaded the paperback. So if you're not adding any pages or anything, it's not going to affect the book cover. Uh, let's see here. So down, down, down. And then we go ahead and save and continue. And this will take us to the last step which is the paperback and paperback rights and pricing page. All that stuff you don't want to probably don't want to change because it's already been set. And then go ahead and click the publish your paperback book. Okay, so basically um, it gives you like the same message that you got when you first put the book up. Um, it says it's going to take up to 72 hours. Okay, so basically what's going to happen after you uh, click uh, publish is that your book, nothing happens to your book, okay? So it's still live, okay? As you can see here, your paper book is still live. So what happens is the updates are happening in the background. So what's going to happen is your book will be reviewed, and if everything looks okay, then they'll put the newest version of your book up. So that's it. So I'll just go to um, the book itself just to show you. So there you go. So as you can see, um, the book is still in stock and nothing is happening. So basically everything is happening uh, in the background. All right. 
So again, if you um, found this video on YouTube or somewhere else, I do have a, a group, a Facebook group called Mastering Amazon's KDP Print Platform. If you felt that the information uh, you found in this video was helpful to you, I invite you to come over to our Facebook group. Um, the link is down below. That's a, a redirect that goes directly uh, to the Facebook group. Uh, those folks who are already in the group and are listening to this, awesome. I hope that you are also uh, benefited uh, by this small tutorial. Alrighty, thanks a lot.